I am Allison Wallace. I'm a florist here at Crone Conservatory. Um, I've been here for 11 years and I take care of the Fern House, the Gale Garden, uh, a third of the Palm House, and I do some floral designs for some of our seasonal floral shows here at Crone. So the current show that we have going on right now is called The Science of Color featuring Prismatica. Um, basically, it's kind of how color relates to nature. So I came up with a theme. Um, I really wanted to do something with color. I always, it was always interesting to me. Um, so based off of that, I tried to figure out which topics kind of related color to nature. And based off of that, created a floor plan so all around the room, there are different topics. Back in the back of the showroom, there's you know the pollinator section. What do pollinators see? How do flowers change their colors to attract pollinators? Um, one section of the room is all about like what is color and how do humans perceive color? Another section of the room is kind of color schemes and how you can design your garden with different color schemes. Uh, usually it's about an, a year in advance. We try to plan our shows. Um, it's, you know, that gives us enough time to secure funding for ordering plants, you know, creating a floor plan, um, doing any of the research. This show we actually had an extra year because uh, it got postponed due to COVID, so I had a lot of extra time to do some fine tuning. The floor arrangement for this show is pretty easy. Uh, theme is color, so I wanted something really saturated, really colorful. Um, I tried to incorporate some variegated plants because that's you know a topic of what is variegation, how do plants get variegated um, leaves, and um, so I got a lot of plants based on the topics um, and usually we grow our plants up at uh, water nursery but sometimes we contract it out. I wanted to incorporate prisms into this show because I thought it would be a pretty cool representation of um, Isaac Newton and how he did the experiments with prisms and he identified the seven colors of the rainbow. Um, so I was researching that and figuring out how we could incorporate that into the show um, and I came across this uh, art installation called Prismatica and they've you know traveled all over the world it's pretty impressive it's really cool so um, we got them here uh, very luckily and love it. I like the way that the prisms and the flowers in the showroom really complement each other um, so you can kind of see the the prisms are reflective so when you spin them you can see all of the flowers reflecting in them it almost kind of creates like a kaleidoscope effect kind of it's really cool. There are a lot of fun facts about color for this show there's a lot of information um, some of the most interesting fun facts that I've learned about color when doing research for this show was that um, nature has to do some tricks to provide a true blue flower like plumbago um, it's not a natural pigment in flowers. Um, another thing that I learned, which I thought was fascinating, was that some flowers um, will actually change the color of their bloom to uh, tell pollinators that they're out of pollen or nectar. Um, so that I found interesting. And the fact that nothing possesses color, it's just light bouncing off of it. So it's pretty interesting. Some of the interactive props that we have in the show um, other than the spinning prisms, you know, those are fascinating in itself. Um, but we also have garden kaleidoscopes um, created by one of our employees here at Parks. And you can look through the kaleidoscopes and spin the flower pot. So it's really cool. Um, we have two of those. And then we also have a bee vision planter. So bees see in ultraviolet light. So our Bee Vision planter has an ultraviolet light in there with some white flowers, um, also surrounded by some darker flowers so you can see the difference. Our summer shows, we usually try to do something educational. Um, this is a little bit bigger than we've done in the past. Um, I think it has a little something for everyone. You know, it has that educational component um, for everyone who wants to read all of the information about color. Um, it has an interactive component. And then it's just, you know, a nice show to peruse through. It's pretty, it's colorful. We hope you come to Crown. Check out the Science of Color featuring Prismatica. Um, it lasts until uh, October 16th.